are the most charismatic, loving, extremely funny, handsome, and incredibly hardworking man I know. I promise to never take for granted the love and joy you bring into my life. I promise to love you in good times and in bad, completely and forever. I'm so grateful for you, and I am so excited for this beautiful life we will build together with our morals at the forefront. You are my best friend, and I love you more than these words can even express, and I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Abby, you are the start, the journey, and the end of the destination of the happiest life I could possibly live. Your love is a God-given gift that I never imagined I would receive, a gift of insurmountable value, and a gift I promise to walk through fire to protect. I vow to always strive to be a better man and husband than I was the day before, forever working towards that unobtainable perfection that you deserve. I could win a billion dollars in the lottery and the best part of that day would still be coming home. And I will say, if we have a daughter, I really hope she looks like me. <laughs> I'm sorry to my future daughter, but if she looks like you, I vow to start taking jujitsu classes and or steroids so that I'm prepared for when we allow her to start dating at age 25. <laughs> I could write a book on my gratitude and love for you. I do by the virtue of the authority vested in me by the laws of the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania pronounce that they are husband and wife and let no one put asunder those who have thus been joined together in the presence of God and before this company. You may kiss the bride. <laughs> To me, there is no question that you are the best friend that anyone could ask for. From midnight phone calls, taking care of me when I'm sick, better than my wife, may I add. And the countless memories as I was writing this speech, because I could not pick from a few. The memories we shared from that day on in Bloom, and the memories we continue to make, I am extremely grateful for. And I pray, as a father of a daughter now, that one day my daughter meets a man like yourself because you are everything that a daughter deserves. And I pray that she finds a man like you. I look forward to watching you attain titles like father as you and Abby grow together. And I can't wait to watch you grow as Mr. and Mrs. Grimm. Congratulations to you both, I love you. Two years ago, I was at the beach with my mom and Abby for the whole family trip that we take to the Outer Banks every year. And Abby stayed back for a couple of days to hang out with Lucas and they were not quite dating yet, but they were hanging out. And she came to the Outer Banks, woke me up at night super rudely, and went on and on and on about this man. She went on and on saying, I know he's the one. I think this is going to go somewhere. This is something I have never felt before. And how she is so confident that she is in the right relationship that is forming. Lucas texted her something that night that I have not forgotten still to this day. He said, if this is what dreaming feels like, I hope I never wake up. <laughs>